In Macon's Ingleside neighborhood, it was the annual 4th of July parade, which they've been celebrating for many years. This was the third year back after a hiatus. Soline Arif takes you to the Ingleside neighborhood and shows us how they're keeping this tradition alive. Um, um. It's hard to find a neighborhood with more red, white, and blue. I like how everybody, everyone was matching and all the colors and tractors and everyone smiling. Jordan Ryans and little brother Jameson Ryans loved their first Ingleside parade. I liked it because I got a flag that has red, white, and blue on it. Those little flags were everywhere in the neighborhood, especially here on the tractor ride. The tractors are sort of a family thing. Uh, one of these tractors around here, uh, my dad grew up on the dairy farm and it was the tractor on the dairy farm. Edward Clark is the most popular name here every fourth. He drives the big tractor for the kids that he's restored from his family farm. And to keep them up and running, you gotta, you gotta run them. So for the past three years, his tractors highlighted the show. He helped bring back the parade along with Lorinda Ebel after it went away for 20 years. We kept hearing about this parade that they used to do years ago and and we've got more and more kids on the street and I'm like, we need to bring this back uh, so the kids will be talking about it 30 years from now. And they say it's about so much more than just hot dogs and watermelons and tractors. It's really about patriotic pride. Yeah, every year it's getting bigger and bigger, so I think yeah. that spirit is been reborn on Riverdale and thanks to Ed yeah. and his tractors and, and, and me and my popsicles and because uh, yeah, yeah, we, <laughs> see, we see more and more flags being hung. It's a fun reminder for cousins Hannah Ebel and Riley Baldwin why they're proud to celebrate America today. I'd say probably some of women's rights and so they can vote. And Ingleside gets their vote for their favorite 4th of July parade. Reporting in Macon, Celine Air, 13 WMEZ News. To keep the fun going, they were handing out prizes for best patriotic costume, best decorated bike and golf cart, and best decorated house.